If you've ever walked out of the salon with less than perfect color, or perhaps had a bad hair dye at home, don't worry, you're not alone. It's happened to the best of us. That's why we brought in lead hair colorist, Beth Minardi, to let us know what to do when bad hair color happens. About some of your celebrity clients and how you found the perfect shade for them. Well, Katrina Bowden from 30 Rock was just in and I gave her a beautiful sterling silver blonde on blonde shade because it, it works so beautifully with her gorgeous skin and eyes. I recently did Uma Thurman's hair, a different kind of rich vanilla and golden blonde on blonde. Again, shade on shade. Why does bad hair dye happen in the salon? I think a lot of the time bad hair dye can happen simply because there was a lack of communication. A client might come in and say she wants to be strawberry or auburn and she might think something different from the colors. So bring a picture, really talk about it. So what happens if a bad hair dye color does happen and you end up with hair that's too dark? Well first of all, don't judge anything until the hair is bone dry. Second of all, don't panic. The first thing I ask a client to do is something very simple at home. I ask her to wait 24 hours and I ask her to shampoo her hair with her regular shampoo with a teaspoon of baking soda in the shampoo and I ask her to allow the lather to stay in the hair for 15 minutes. If it's still too dark, it's time to call the colorist. And then what happens if we've gone too light? Yeah, it's really bad when someone comes in and all of a sudden the hair is almost too white or too light. The best way to do this is rather than just dump something all over the head, I like to take selected little threads, little threads of hair, and I paint on deeper caramel or sandstone or suede or butterscotch strands into the hair, and we call these low lights. And what if we're taking our hair that's starting to turn gray and we're starting to dye it on a regular basis? The best possible way to take those first few hairs from gray back to your natural without changing anything is to use a cream demi-permanent color at your salon. These contain no ammonia and no ammonia substitute. They have the brain to change the gray hair while leaving your natural hair super shiny in great condition and no one will know. They'll just say, I thought you had some gray. I guess not. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. I hope you never have a bad hair dye again, and if you do, you can always rewatch this video. I'm Anna, this is the lovely Beth Minardi, and thanks for watching New Beauty.